This is the Lake Forest College Super Double. A two-person living arrangement that fits four people. These are super popular at Lake Forest College. Only 32 available per year to sophomores, juniors, and seniors. What makes these dorms so popular is that it enables the most space for a student while also giving them a private bathroom and a roommate. It's basically two doubles sandwiching a walk-in closet. I was lucky enough to get this dorm my senior year. Let me take you on a tour of my super double. So starting right off the bat, you and your roommate have a choice. You can either room together and have your own common room, or you can each have your own private rooms. I chose to have my own private room. My roommate was fine with that as well. And I went with the front because I was only there for a semester. My roommate was gonna be there for the full year. Once my living arrangements were decided, next was rearranging the room. Super doubles are given all the supplies that regular quads are. Four beds, four desks, four chairs, four dressers. I put my two doubles together and made a California King while my roommate only used his single double and disassembled his bed. I then chose to go with the higher bedding so I could put more stuff under it while my roommate went with the lower bedding and made it easier for him to get on his bed. With being in the front room, you have an extra closet space to store shoes, boots, coats for going outside. I added an entry mat and a shoe tray to collect all the snow and rain that was going on throughout the school year. And also arranged my extra desks so it added a bedside table that hold all my keys my ID and my phone that were ready to go in the morning. The bathrooms are better than having a communal bathroom for sure. The one thing about the shower is that it's very hard to gauge the temperature of the water. What I found the easiest trick was to turn the hot all the way up while just emerging it in very slow increments of cold water to get the perfect temperature. When decorating the rooms in Roberts, McClure, or Gregory quads or super doubles, they're given these wood that run along the ceilings that you can nail into to hang lights, flags. It's difficult because a lot of the walls are brick to tape posters to. So I found it best to just get some masking tape and just pray that it doesn't tear the poster or fall off the wall. Then came the blinds. The blinds don't do if you need the nap during the day or unfortunately pick a door that is right next to the light outside that stuff's gonna shine bright like a diamond so I invested in some blackout shades and had a poster on hand that was more vertical that could cut out the light that was shining through the window with the lighting setup you don't want anything looking like the basement of the silence of lambs house so I put three-point lighting around the room included a simple desk lamp natural living room lamp and some cylinder expanded Pringle box looking lamp. I also had some string lights that didn't really do stuff but added a cool aesthetic. Finally, I had a couch and it was a love seat which enabled to just fit in my sized dorm while also giving me enough room to stretch. My roommate who only chose to have his one double up allowed him to have a full size couch and enough room for activities. The next thing was electrical outlets. I had a nice electrical tree that helped me out with the string light, one that can connected right up to the bed. And I made this contraption where I could freely move my room fan from the window. If I wanted to filter in some new air, the rooms will naturally heat up with or without the heat switch on. So you're gonna have a room most likely that's having its window open a lot of the time throughout the school year. Now with the bed, naturally these things are super springy. Invested in a very nice board that prevented this thing from dipping too much. It comes with two mattresses and then we put like these foam things over to like block the crease as much as I could and then you get a king-sized mattress cover and then you get a, a sheet that goes over the mattress cover and then you got your blankets on top and that way it doesn't like feel as much of a divot as it usually does and then you're gonna have some space in between your pillow and the brick wall. You don't want any concussions, so I implemented a body pillow as well as some extra pillows just in case to prevent me from getting CTE. I hope you enjoyed the video. If you decide to go to Lake Forest College, definitely try to work your way to get a super double.